Bhutan, a tiny, beautiful country of the Thunder Dragon that's strewn across the majestic folds of the Himalayas. Like all Bhutanese, uh, I like to collect thangkas, I like to view thangkas. It, it gives you focus and can fulfill you spiritually. Uh, when an old thangka is lost, especially if it is a sacred art, it is a deep loss, not just for the owner, but for the entire nation. When a Thangka is restored and reconsecrated by spiritual masters, it has a new life and it bestows blessings of the past. And also, most importantly, it hands down to future generations a cultural legacy that is continued for many generations to come. The monks have been doing this for quite some time now, and it's basically second to nature to them because Tanka is a part of their culture, their religion, and their practices. It's like a story, and people should understand it's a story that, you know, it's part of you and part of who you are as a Bhutanese. So I think in that way, I hope the next generation will understand it like that and not some, you know, just, just a painting that they pass by.